Hello, I'm Jerry Rigged, and this is the Duskers Daily Challenge for September 2nd, 2017. Looking at yesterday's leaderboard, a total of 30 entries on the higher end. Oh, wow, it's late. I thought I got all those out before I started recording. Uh, looking at the leaderboard, we have Copper with a 980. Congratulations, Copper. Most definitely uh, surviving the few pitfalls of that ship, especially that pipe burst in R2 that I'm sure a lot of people hit, even looking at the top 10. Behind Copper, as I try to clear my eyes, we have Darguard at 970. Stardire, new name, at 950. Morelius at 920. I scored a 914, taking, I believe it was 16 points of radiation damage. LB scored an 876. Fax Tolgen, 865. Peak, 850. Dano 416 and 845, Quietus 11 and 836. Moving on into my friends list, we have Nock at 14th with an 805, Matichi at 19th with 683, and Marvin at 20th with 665. Not the deadliest of ships, but there were definitely some pitfalls that could be had there. <clears throat> Between that radiation potentially stranding drones on a ship with no safe, reliable way out. <clears throat> and just the radiation itself. Today we have reroute power, remote power, and motion again. And I have at least a little bit slightly higher than average drone health. It's also just getting cold enough here that my fingers are starting to feel the chill. And so, yeah, might want to close my windows a little bit one day. I'll, I'll think about that. Today we have one infestation type on a barge beast, so this could be nice, could not be nice, depending on what we find. That door's open. This is a decent sized room. No scrap in the first room. That's a little surprising from a barge. And only five, six rooms. I want to check something real quick. That's kind of a bad sign. That means we could be dealing with slime. It's not a guarantee by any means. Good, something did move. R6, I don't know. Oh, it's leapers. Okay, so I don't have to worry about the vent. And... I have reroute power, which means I can do wonderful things today. R2, R4, it's also going to be a very fast ship. See if anything moves from R7. I don't have to worry about slime today. Only one infestation. So I can do this the very simple, easy, direct way. Direct-ish way. I can actually... Completely forgot about that part. And do I want to dock to A2 and check R7? It's actually docked a four and send drone three in there. Wait. Yeah. If I'm gonna be juggling things around, that'll probably work just as well as anything else.
Honestly, I should have kept the motion on just to see if... I can't check that room either. That is a problem. How do I deal with this? <clears throat> Well, before anything bad happens, let's go ahead and get off the ship. How can I deal with this? I don't like doing this. A couple of the other guys are really good at this, but not me. It's not my style of trick. It's a good trick, don't get me wrong. Just always nervous about it. Alright, I don't believe I had a ship scan on either of those terminals, so... That's pretty much lost on me. It's kind of a shame, because when you have remote and reroute... That's a fantastic thing to have. And for a barge to be so empty... Nope, no ship scan. That is a shame. Alright, so very simple episode. Very simple ship, rather. Uh, very short episode. Total score of 740. 8 scrap, 1 jump fuel. Starting score of 560. And that's it. I don't think I missed anything. Ash White definitely had better drone health, or maybe worse drone health in ship scan. Tatuya 3 IFN, Noxkitney, Dano, myself, and Mactenchi, all of 740. Peak and LB, uh, Peak is 680, LB is 660. That's missing four scrap. Or significantly lower drone health. Actually, maybe. Maybe LB didn't chance it. That's all I can think of. And Squeon got a zero. Uh, that is a name that I believe... I mean, it's not new-new, but it's newer. So it wouldn't surprise me terribly if they just had a bad run of it and ran afoul of a Leaper. Some Leapers do take some time to move, so that can lead to bad decisions based on misinformation. So, if you haven't done your run yet, good luck. Uh, fairly simple ship today, but at the same time, Zguion proves bad things can happen. And could may have accidentally uh, opened up an airlock. That happens too sometimes. I know this from experience. <clears throat> uh, so, if you haven't done your run yet, good luck. If you have, leave a comment with your own experiences and strategies. Uh, I'd love to hear of your own... Uh, method for approaching a ship like this. Uh, did you go the same route that I did, or a different one? If you would like to check out other playthroughs, you can see Marvin, Copper, Deno416, LB, Noxkitney, Vaxtolja, Ion Mark III, and Agenta1999, all linked in the video description. If you enjoyed, do please like, and have a good day.